why would UBI be like the outcome of AGI or ASI? It seems like wealth concentration is the natural direction set in motion by capitalism, which will only quicken the pace. I've talked about that earlier when it comes to things like compute governance or offense defense balance and how it seemed like we were headed toward highly egalitarian and low ability to control. And this maybe moves us back toward inequality and more ability to control. But I don't think this is the last word on that either, right? The core models are probably going to continue to get better. I fully expect what you can run on a laptop will continue to advance. How does that play out? One possible way is that there could be a decoupling. And arguably, this I think it has happened in Scandinavian societies. People can call me out here because I'm not an expert on uh, Scandinavian societies. But I think you look at a, a society like Sweden, my understanding is that there is wealth concentration and hereditary passing down of important companies. There is an elite that controls important institutions of society, but there is also a, a generous, robust social safety net. People are looked after. I think something like that could be maybe the way that this goes, like in a future where resource owners will have a lot, of, but individuals will benefit from access. This is kind of the Ahmad vision, right? What if everybody had access to top quality guidance? What if expertise was effectively free or very low cost? Some version of that, I guess, would be my sort of best guess w with major caveat that like the future is probably going to be weird. A couple governments and a handful of big tech champions own the physical capital, do the frontier development, and basically are like deciding amongst themselves like how the future is going to go. And then everybody else is like living very comfortably and has, for practical purposes, like access to incredible expertise. That seems like the new social contract we're headed for. Because compute and decision making power remain scarce. Who trains the $100 billion model and on what hardware? At that level, it's going to be scarce. If you want to spend a million dollars inferencing on one problem, it's scarce. So I think there is abundance in many ways, abundance of, of expertise, abundance of creative tools. But it seems like decision-making and capital could end up quite concentrated.